So hello guys welcome back to the channel and this video will cover another amazing lab that is create and manage pick table and science challenge lab so first of all click on start lab after that open the cloud console incognito window and a lot of you guys are facing issues on particular task i will handle this and tell you how you can complete it so just stay tuned meanwhile if you are new to this channel like the video and subscribe the channel now click on i understand it's time to activate your cloud shell so let's activate the cloud shell so how you can activate the cloud shell you have to click on this button let me show you which button you have to click now here you have to click on continue and just authorize yourself let me show you how you have to do just click on continue and just authorize yourself now in the description box of this video i have shared one github repo you have to check it out so how will find the repo just check in the description of this video so here is the description copy first one and just paste over here now it will take some time now here are some manual steps which you need to do because some of the tasks are failing so just wait for it So now first of all we need to create big table instance so before that click on this url just like i clicked now here you have to enter the instance name which are present in the lab instruction so let's move to the lab instructions and set our instance so first of all copy name from here it instance id will be automatically set the type is sst now we have to click on continue and add the cluster id remove the extra space like this Select the region and for zone, make sure to check the lab instruction only. Now we have to update the maximum and minimum number of instances. Update the maximum, 5. Always update as per lab instruction. Now click on create. It will take few seconds. So just wait for it. So finally our instance is now ready. Now hit check my progress for this task. Now what you need to do, go back to the lab instruction, type Y and then hit enter. It will start executing. And here basically we have to run two jobs and after that we have to do one more thing that is we have to add cluster to this instance so we'll cover all the topics no need to worry about it now from here just open the jobs from the search box now here you will see two jobs let me show you here so these the status will update from running to succeeded wait for the status as you can see it's starting it will be running and then it will be updated to succeeded so we need to wait for a few minutes and after that we will move forward to the next step of this lab so just wait you can refresh also or reload also as per you better refresh it and till now do not click type y and hit enter because you may face unnecessary error here we have to do some manual steps also
now here you can do one thing you can see the status is succeeded now you check my progress and you will definitely get the score so if you don't get the score just wait for a few more seconds now the next step is that we have to add a cluster so let's hit check my progress for the task so we are not getting for this replication task so let's leave it we'll do it now so what we have to do we have to add a cluster first let's see the score for all the remaining tasks so we have got 60 out of 80 and for one task that is of 10 points we have to configure this replication in big table so for that we have to add a cluster now as for this task you need to go back video. to your instance and from here you can see here you have to click on this add and add a cluster now just click on add cluster enter the name from here like this select the region it will be same as for lab instruction and select any zone so now here what you need to do is make sure to update as per task number one like we did for creation of this cluster so what we need to do you can see from here configuration that the maximum number of instance will be five and just click on save so now just click on save it will take some time so wait for it and it's added now we'll hit check my progress will definitely get the score without any issue and if you haven't subscribed to the channel subscribe it and like the video now click on this so we got the score now we have only left with the last task that is 80 out of 80 that we have to delete the all the instance so just move to this part type y and hit enter now this task may take some additional time also sometimes this task doesn't work so i will show you how you can execute this task so just follow the way i am doing now what you need to do is when you will try to hit check my progress you may face issues sometimes for the last task i meant to see that is the big table data so the issue will be resolved automatically or you can do one thing go to instance select this and just open it and delete now enter this name and just click on delete it will take few minutes so just wait for it and just follow the way i am doing the video So as you can see instance is deleted now now you wait for a few more seconds and then if you are unable to get the score just wait and try again so keep hitting check my progress and wait after a few seconds and try again and as you can see we got the score without any issue and we are done with the lab do like the video and subscribe the channel thank you guys have a